nyo mwenda mwenda vanda wa wano na te mko miye wo Okusinze liyo nene jetubade Fako mchitegeza farming consult and management company Wano we mula batuli jivaite walu kondo chichusa Wala dala na ila sinyo mwana tuweche uniso kufe kampala Na yo kufa wano Echintu chino chone 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 mwana yali swamp area Senga mchuka Ne mutunula ke mabiga Mabiga kwa wali yeri Mabiga mwja kulaba swamp unge ya ukana Urudaru nore tuliko Urudaru eno Na urudaru eri Soro kulaba nge uro nene nyo dala Na itu ya jichu usa Netani kwa kuteka mwe miyala Teka mwe drainage systems Amazi nkuba nebo yeto nyo kumare wiki Kamba kakas Nebo imaro mwezi Amazi teka soro na kutula wali yeri Muna wabi nubi muze yu kampara kwa isi mazi gajula Yu urusi mwita na government hivyo wako lila Na here we do it fefe njini No sara wano ganti no Tuteme miyala Tusoburo kutu kwa gaya Kupanga wako limina wake ndende Tetuche ayono na chisenyi Chisenyi nwe wachi wachi juda mazi Nwe wachi wachi tunu wachitia Tusoburo kuchichu usa ni chifuko urukaru Hamazi nwetuga wa sistemu yago Mwaka waga itila So Neyanzi za neyanzi ya kikatika tuwe yungere ya wala Tulabebi didila Yala ojao yeah, uh, my name is uh, Wanzala Nathan. I'm a Mugisu, and uh, I was so fortunate to have met uh, Mr. Iga from Fakom. Fakom is uh, basically a farming and consultancy uh, farm, and they they really do what they call education, agricultural education. You have any question to ask, they are going to answer it. I've been confident enough to confide myself in him, and in a few weeks I've been with him. Trust me, I think I've gained wealth that the youth out there need to know about farming. Some of us have left the city and uh, we are not complaining, but some of us are selling off land that is resourceful and should have been used to better their livelihoods. And they're requesting government to come and help. They're asking for youth fund. I don't even understand what youth fund is because if I have my two million or even less, I can come and talk to this gentleman and we do a partnership, you know, life is about what you want to make it. If you want to be poor, you're definitely going to be poor. I am a rich person, starting from when I met him. I already have acquired a few acres and I intend to expand with him. So come join us. Let's be one. Let's breathe as youths and uh, quite honestly, you're not going to complain. Thank you so much. Fako. This is a fetomet, and I was introduced to this farm by one of my friends, Nathan. Having heard of a radio, we managed to locate the manager of this farm. There are so many things that we, we have learned in this farm. For instance, uh, the, the way the, the wetlands are transformed and how you harvest that water to store before you, you can release it to, to follow its own route, its original route without destroying the environment. Uh, for instance, look at these, uh, these, 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 these bushes. Many people have feared to come to these bushes because they imagine nothing can come out of it. But if you looked where we came from, you realize that what was a bush is no more, is now a farm usable and uh, what you expect out of it is very interesting one that you would not imagine to have, to have happened uh, for for now that is that's what i can tell you but i would advise that everybody should take this more or less like a hobby because what you get out of it is happiness joy and so many other things that you may not be able to explain unexplainable not until you get to this level yeah, my name is Irene Nakoa. I'm uh, a 
concerned citizen of this country, first of all. I did not know this is the extent to which farming can go and make you love something you never ever thought you would put your hands on. I am here today under an ordinary circumstance. I'll probably be in some office somewhere planning a small business where the rate is so strange. But when I heard about Fakon, I actually heard about it through my brother, he's called Nathan. He told me about it and I don't know, for some reason, this seemed like the most convincing farming activity I've ever had of. So I took up the initiative, I asked questions, looked at the figures, but I was looking at now, investing now, not looking at how much, because how much was not the problem. It's, be, it's about being long-sighted, in my opinion. So I wish every Ugandan would take up that spirit and do it like a, do it as a passion, something they love. But you can't love something without looking beyond the eyes, you know. So things like bushes being transformed into an ordinary farm. Someday I'll probably stand in this spot and I'll say I remember this day because I stood here and this is where it all began. So for so many who have seen the light, please hands on. And for those of you who have not, I advise you one thing, just run. Because uh, this, this is the oldest business. From Bible days, there is no nation that has not transformed from farming. So open the eyes. That's my piece of advice. And I love to appreciate Farcom. Because without it, I wouldn't have known the networking, the one-on-one -on -one approach in terms of marketing. What is this thing about? For me to see a swamp being trans, tra, tra, uh, transformed into flat, neat gardens. The beauty of a garden, not to be so stressful, is how neat and, maintain, and how neat it's maintained. Because it's just like looking about something beautiful. You want to look at it and look at it some more. You even give it some more because you see, you organized it from the beginning. Everyone be concerned in what you do. Love it and I assure you success. Is the lip, is what on, what is the name one's lips? Thank you. Wow. So that was my issue. Yeah. Just more. Now we got the new, but since we're not going to talk about it, we're going to have to.